It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Beautiful day in the neighborhood. Won't you be mine? Won't you be mine? Won't you be my neighbor? If you find the one, you should never give her up. I think it's the way life changes when in love, yeah. I surround my soul with the positivity. That's why I don't worry about the things that I don't see, yeah. It's a foot spa portable and it just is heights. Um, 
my feet need some tender loving care so I'm gonna go ahead and do that today since I finished my homework got that out the way so I do have my nails to do but I said let me go ahead and tackle my feet first so let's get cracking So I'm sitting here enjoying this foot spa. It's not bad. Uh, I made the water a little too hot, but I'm able to get my feet all the way in. It's doing, it's, it's really nice so far. I have no complaints. This is a good idea because I've been wanting to just sit and relax with my feet in some massaging water for months. Because I haven't done it since before COVID. And now that they're back open the prices are ridiculous and i'm just not about that life so yeah i'm happy i got this to do this at home this is great August 26th. Um, today, we, meaning my kids and I, are going to Universal Studios with my mom and my sister, my older sister. Um, this is a scheduled day off. Uh, this isn't a given day off. Um, it's kind of like an end of summer um, trip with my mom because uh, she hasn't done anything with us this summer. Just both sides is very, very busy. So, let a end of summer kind of trip. Um, the kids are getting ready and I'm about to pick out my outfit for the day. I haven't been to Universal Studios since The Mummy came out. That's so long ago. I don't even rem I don't even remember. But when The Mummy ride came out, that was the last time I've been. So I'm excited. The kids has never been. They have no idea what to expect. Yeah, it's not tons of rides like Magic Mountain, but it's still some impressive rides and a nice trip so and they got the new like harry potter thing i'm excited so we're going to universal end of summer Yay! Yay!
Uh, we just went on about a bring more people. Jurassic World. It doesn't matter. I'm soaking wet. Now we're on the Transformers Canadian. Next time. That was an experience. Like that one crusty, it's hot. Hold on. Crusty, the clown freaking ride. Like 
if you remember back to the future back in the day it's the same thing as when you go and you sit in a little chair lift you up into a big old stadium with a huge screen and it's just you know the chair is just sitting there and i knew when i did back to the future that i couldn't handle that mccon i get motion sickness very easy but when we stand in line i thought it was going to be an actual i didn't realize it was the same simulation. They, they just changed it from Back to the Future to Krusty. And so right in the beginning, once that screen came on and that chair started moving, I just closed my eyes. I took out my little hand fan and dealt with all that. Because if I, I swear, I thank God I bought that hand fan. If I didn't have that hand fan, the whole front row, my family would have got thrown it up on, period. I had that fan in the top of my head until we got that ride and I had to sit down for like 15 minutes after the ride and I was just nauseated throughout the day it literally threw off my equilibrium so I was nauseated the rest of the day I didn't want to eat every time the kids went somewhere I sat my ass down y'all saw the clip horrible like I can't if it's like if you're gonna have a simulation where you're just sitting there and it's just have wind blowing on your your customers there's the Transformers one was cool because it was cold inside and you can feel the wind. I was cool in the Transformers because the Transformers ride is kind of similar. But the crusty one, there's no wind blowing. It was kind of humid in there. You're in there with like, I don't know, maybe 30 other people all up in the air in this stadium screen, whatever. Like, you guys need AC blowing in there and in the individual little carts. I'm just going to let y'all know about that. Anyway... After that, we went on the tram to go around the, you know, the little uh, celebrity uh, movie star studio clips and whatnot. And I couldn't really enjoy that because, you know, the tram is bumpy and riding. And then there's three different stops where you actually get and locked in. And it's the same thing. It's a simulation and the cart is just sitting there moving. So once again, I'm laying my head on my shoulder, son. I mean, <laughs> on my son's shoulder. With the fan in my face, not looking at Fast and the Furious clip, not looking at the earthquake scene. Like, I didn't even care. I'm like, I'm just on this train. My family's enjoying everything. It was just not a good universal rest of the day for me. But um, the kids had fun, which I'm grateful for. My sister had fun. Lots of laughs. Lots of cute pictures. But, um, yeah, now I know universal. I can't do, like, two-thirds of your rides due to motion sickness. Y'all need some more roller coasters or something. Because, damn. Anywho, I'm tired. I'm on my way to work. Um, I had to wake up a little early. <laughs> I don't have time to do anything. So I had to order my groceries um, at Walmart this morning. So once I get off work, I can just go pick up my groceries. Because I don't have time to do them. Tonight is another event. Which is why I'm tired and dreading. Because it was just so happened to be back to back. Um, we're going to an escape room with my kids cousins down below um, It's their one of their birthdays and we were going to do Benihana, but they changed it to an escape room um, I'm not Thrilled about escape rooms. I don't like the feel of it. I don't like the anxiety it gives so <laughs> I just put it out there if they let me pack I'm packing because I don't trust situations like that when I say packing, I mean my little pocket knife, which I'm going to find a way to squeeze the fuck in anyway. Anyway, sorry, but I'm not playing. And then Nina, the mom, she's not going in, so she's going to let the kids go. Oh, no, I'm going with my kids. Sorry, I paid my extra ticket. I'm going in with my kids because if anything go wrong, I'm cracking off and we leaving, period. I'm sorry. I just have a bad vibe by escape rooms, but hopefully it's a fun experience. But if not, y'all going to hear it on the news. Like mom went crazy at escape room, didn't trust nobody, started slashing. I don't know. Okay, so it's Saturday, about 6.30. We're gonna go grab something to eat first and then head down to this escape room. This is my outfit, blue tank, black pants, white Adidas, and a white jacket because it's cold. <sighs> Excited, but not really. Let's see how this works.
Life changes when in love, yeah